Most of you know the story about Yeshua showing up to give me communion in the airplane. And uh, one of the things that he was teaching me is the word says many are sick and many have died because they have not rightly understood this principle. One of the reasons why we're sick and still dying is because we take an eternal covenantal arrangement and try it, uh, try to uh, administer it from a temporal realm. So one of the things that we're going to do tonight, because you're all ascenders and you're here because you know that, one, one of the things he said is if when you take my, my body and you drink my blood, you will ascend into the heavens and step behind the veil, this body and this blood actually produce the restoration of immortality because it's now being administered from the eternal realm, not from the temporal realm. So I'm just going to begin with a simple little prayer, and I want you all to close your eyes, and we're going to step out of this realm into that realm, and we're going to step behind the veil and take the body and the blood from the eternal, timeless, endless place in the heavens. Thank you, Father. Yes, Lord. We just, we just want to say how much we love you. And as we ascend and leave to come into your presence in the heavenly realms, we stand as one being with one mind, with one purpose, with one direction, with one voice. Before the veil... And we step into the Holy of Holies to receive our spiritual DNA. Oh Lord, the word says on the night that you were betrayed, you lifted up the bread and you broke it. And you said to the disciples, this is my body. You didn't say this is a picture of my body or this is an element or this is a sign of my body. You said, this is my body that was broken for you for the remission of sins. Take and eat ye all of it. So Lord, as we lift up your body tonight, we're so thankful that you were willing to give your body to be a living sacrifice so that we could be one with Abba Father. As we take this body tonight, we say that it's going to infuse our bodies with the restoration of the dew of our youth, with the restoration of longevity, with the restoration of immortality. And we just say thank you, thank you, thank you. In Yeshua's holy name. Let's eat our bread. (laughs) Mm. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Yeshua. Thank you, Ruach HaKodesh. Thank you, Lord. Hmm. That on that same night, Lord, you lifted up the cup. The cup that had never been drunk from before. The cup that was reserved during the whole age of Israel for the coming of Messiah. Lord, we thank you that when you lifted up the cup, you didn't say, this is a symbol of my blood. This is a picture of my blood. You said, this is my blood. As we lift up our cups to you tonight, Lord, we thank you that your blood contains the perfect, undefiled spiritual DNA from heaven. That as we partake of your blood tonight, Lord, we decree and declare that we will be liberated from the limited capacities of our humanity and the DNA in uh, in our natural DNA and released into the limitlessness of our spiritual DNA because our spiritual DNA is in your blood. We just want to thank you so much that you loved us so much 
that you shed your precious blood so that we could be one, one with the Father, one with you, one with the Holy Spirit, and one with one another. And we just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So even as we allow your body and your blood to infiltrate our systems, Lord, we just decree and declare that we, by our own volition, sever and separate ourselves from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. And by our own desire, we engraft ourselves into the tree of life. We thank you, Lord, that you are the tree, that you are the way, that you are the truth, that you are the life. Let your life now begin to flow through us in a way that can produce your light, your fire, your spirit, and full-blown manifestations in the earthly realm. It's a mystery. It is a mystery. But Lord, we thank you that we are becoming the greatest mystery ever seen in humanity in addition to you and in compliment to you, that it is in you that we find our eternal purpose. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We just want to express our love. We just want to sing our love to you. We love you, Lord, and we our voice to worship you, O oh, our Lord. Yes, 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 come on. Rejoice, take joy, my King, in what you hear. Let it be a sweet, sweet sound. Repeat that. Let it be a sweet, sweet sound. Let us. Let us be a sweet, sweet sound in your ear. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you. In that beautiful name above all other names, Messiah Yeshua. Thank you. Thank you.